Welcome to Black History Month. Here are facts about Black History Month. Black History Month honors the contributions of African Americans to U.S. history. Among the figures are Madam C.J. Walker, who was the first U.S. woman to become a self-made millionaire, George Washington Carver, who derived nearly 300 products from the peanut nut, Rosa Parks, who sparked the Montgomery Bus Boy Scout and the Civil Rights Movement, and Shirley was the first African-American woman elected to the United States House of Representatives. Black History Month is the celebration of Black History Month. Began as Blank History Week, which was created in 19... 1926 by Carter G. Woodson, a noted African-American historian, scholar, educator, and publisher. It became a month-long celebration in 1976. The month of February was chosen to coincide with the birthdays of Frederick Douglass and Abraham Lincoln. John Mercer Langston was the first black man to become a lawyer when he passed the bar in Ohio. In 1854, when he was elected to the post of town clerk for Brown Helm, Ohio, in 1855, Langston became one of the first African Americans ever elected to public office in America. John Mercer Langston was also the great uncle of Langston Hughes, famed poet of the Harlem. While Rosa Parks is credited with helping to spark the civil rights movement when she refused to give up her public bus seat to a white man in Montgomery, Alabama in 1955 in springing the Montgomery Bus Boy Scout, the lesser known Claudette Colvin was arrested nine months prior to not giving up her bus seat to white passengers. Marshall was the first African American ever appointed to the U.S. Supreme Court. He was appointed by President Lyndon B. Johnson and served on the court from 1967 to 1991. George Washington Carver developed 300 derivative products from peanuts among them cheese, milk, coffee, flour, ink, dyes, plastics, wood stains, soap, linoleum, medical oils, and cosmics. Rhodes was the first African American ever elected to the U.S. Senate. He represents 
visited the state of Mississippi from February 1870 to March 1871. First woman representative Shirley was the first African American woman elected to the House of Representatives. She was elected in 1968 and represented the state of New York. She broke ground again four years later in 1972 when she was the first major party African American candidate and the first female candidate for president of the United States. Jack Johnson became the first African American man to hold the world heavyweight champion boxing title in 1909. He held on to the belt until 1915. On April 5th, 1947, Jackie Robinson became the first African American to play Major League Baseball when he joined the Brooklyn Dodgers. He led the league in stolen bases that season and was named Rookie of the Year. Athena Gibson became the first African American to complete in Pro World Tennis Tour and in 1956 the first African American woman to win a Grand Slam title. Overall, Gibson garnered 11 Grand Slam wins, including six single titles. Next, Gibson turned to professional golf and made more history by becoming the first African-American competitor on the Women's Pro Golf Tour in the 1916. Self-Made Millionaires Madam C.J. Walker was born on a cotton plantation in Louisiana and became wealthy after inviting a line of African-Americans Hair care products. She established Madam C.J. Walker Laboratories and was also known for her philanthropy. Sorry if I'm saying that wrong. In 1940, Haiti McDaniel was the first African American performer to win an Academy Award the film industry highest honor to her portrayal of a loyal slave governess is gone with the wind. Before opera, Winfrey and Michael Jordan joined the Billionaires Club. Robert Johnson became the first African American American billionaire. When he sold the cable station, he found black entertainment television. In 2008, Barack Obama became the first black president of the United States. In January 2021, Kamala Harris became the first woman of African or Asian descent to become vice president. Harris' mother immigrated to the United States from India and her father immigrated from Jamaica. The black population of the United States in 1870 was 4.8 million. In 2020, the U.S. Hunsis found there were 46.9 million black residents in the United States, and the number of people identify 
in, with more than one race increased by more than 276% since the 2010 census. Spared by growing racial violence in the early 20th century and particularly by 1909 race riots in Springfield, Illinois, a group of African American leaders joined together to form a new permanent civil rights organization, the National Association for the Advisement of Colored People, February 12th. 1909 was chosen because it was the central anniversary of the birth of Abraham Lincoln. So, that is what Black History Month facts are. Um, we have Rosa Parks, which we all know her. All right. So July 26, 1948, President Harry Truman issued Executive Order 9981 to end segregation in the armed services. May 17, May 17, 1954, Brown v. Board of Ed Education, a consolidation of five cases into one, is decided by the Supreme Court effectively ending racial segregation in public schools. Many schools, however, remain segregated. August 28, 1955, Emmett Till, a 14-year-old from Chicago is brutally murdered in Mississippi for allegedly flirting with a white woman. His murders are acquitted and the case brings international attention to the civil rights movement. After Jet Magazine publishes a photo of Till's beaten body, at his open casket fun funeral. December 1st, 1955, Rosa Parks refused to give up her seat while seat to a white man on the Montgomery, Alabama bus. Her defense stance prompts a year-long Montgomery bus boys cow. So, yeah. There are some fun facts and stuff. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed Peace.